If your car starts but it's overheating and or leaking, you'll want to have the radiator pressure tested in order to discover the source of the leak. Hi, I'm Barbara Terry with AutoMD. In order to determine the source of the leaks, you'll need to have your cooling system pressure tested. A radiator may leak as a result of normal wear and tear. Parts and tools needed. If a pressure test reveals that a radiator needs to be replaced, a new radiator and engine coolant will be needed. Additionally, you will need a pressure tester. Your own vehicle's components and parts may differ, so always refer to your vehicle's owner's manual for details. For your safety, we recommend wearing safety glasses, latex gloves, and closed-toed shoes when working on your vehicle. Open your hood and locate your vehicle's radiator. Inspect the radiator for damage, corrosion, and leaks. Do not remove the radiator cap while the engine is warm. With the engine off and cold, install the cooling system pressure tester by following the tool's instructions. Pressurize the radiator and inspect it for leaks, making sure to check along the size of the tank. Finally, pressure test the radiator cap to see if the radiator needs to be replaced. On behalf of AutoMD, I'm Barbara Terry with How to Pressure Test Your Radiator.